The safety of you and your passenger should never be taken lightly. Proper preparation for both expected and unexpected situations can make the difference between life and death. Know where your emergency equipment is and how to use it, and always have an exit plan in case of a fire. Have a fire extinguisher, flashlight, and emergency flotation devices readily accessible. Before you go to bed, place your life jacket in a readily accessible spot so you can quickly grab it if necessary. Carbon monoxide is a colorless, odorless, and tasteless gas that can kill someone. It is produced by engines, generators, cooking ranges, space, and water heaters. Ensure your vessel has proper ventilation to prevent the gas from accumulating. CO detectors should be on board and active on your houseboat. If the alarm goes off, safely turn off the engine, open all the windows on board, and exit the boat with your life jackets on. If possible, exit to a beach away from the boat. CO collects in open spaces around a houseboat when the engine is running. This danger zone extends 30 feet around the boat, and swimmers should avoid this area. It's important that you take proper precautions while swimming as well. Never jump or dive from a moving houseboat. Do not swim underneath the boat, behind the ladder, or near the propeller. Never operate the boat while swimmers are in the water. Always operate the houseboat at safe speeds. Take extra caution when navigating close to shore, as submerged, unseen objects can cause damage to the boat. Most houseboats have lockable sliding doors, a latching gate, and railing around the perimeter of the vessel. Ask your rental agency to identify the safety features on your vessel, especially when traveling with children. Remember that it's your responsibility as the boat operator to take the proper safety precautions. Proper precautions can be the difference between life and death.